Jonathan here with Central Sound. I am going to show you how to replace your headband pad on your Sony WH-1000XM2 and also the MDR-1000X. Please consider liking and subscribing if you find this video helpful. Here we have our replacement headband pad and these are fairly easy to install. There is some double-sided tape and here's the old headband pad. You can see it's worn out. The material is kind of cracking and flaking. Um, first thing you do is get a small type of sharp uh, instrument. Here I'm using a small box cutter and it's a very thin razor and you would just pry into this little area right here where there is a cap, kind of like a cover, and that just pops right out. It has clips that hold it in place. And now you can see there's a couple of screws, and they are Phillips screws, so you would need a Phillips screwdriver, a very small one. And here I'm just going to pop the cover off on the other side. And now I'm going to get busy unscrewing these screws. Now once the screws are unscrewed, you can remove the plastic components, put them aside, and this just peels off. Uh, you kind of want to pry it apart because uh, it is on there pretty good sometimes. So um, I'm using a small tool, a spreader kind of tool. And then once it's loosened up on both sides, uh, you can use your fingers. Just be careful not to tear or rip any of the wires that are inside. There's one wire that actually runs through the middle. There it is. So just be careful. Hold that in place while you're uh, peeling off the old headband pad. And there's the old one. And here's the new one. Now there are small plastic clips that you want to make sure the wire go into. So here I'm prying the wire into those little underneath those little plastic clips and I'm just making sure that they are all tucked in there and here there's a, at each end there is a plastic nub that kind of fits in just like that so you want to want to fit that in on both sides and then just make sure that that wire is tucked in there in the headband pad So here I'm just checking to make sure everything's lined up, flush, even, and installed all the way. Now that everything looks good, it's time to remove the backing from the double-sided tape. I find it easy to use a small utensil to kind of pull it up and loosen it up. Here I'm using a small box cutter. I just want to peel a little piece up just to get it going. And gently just pull off the backing. And pull off this extra little piece here. little piece got stuck. Get that out of there. There we go. A little minor bump in the road. All right, then just apply some pressure. And it will take about an overnight or so to kind of set in once you do um, Take the backing off. So here I have the other side and I'm going to get the other piece off. You can use a small pair of tweezers like, like this example as well if, you, if you'd like. And pretty simple. Now once you applied pressure all the way around and it's on there pretty solid, you can apply the plastic uh, brackets that hold it in place. So you want to install the inner one first 
and then the outer one. So here's the inner one. And then stick the outer piece right through those two holes. And then the screws are going to be what's holding it together. Let's go ahead and put those two screws back into place. And now you just clip the plastic cover piece back into place. So now you just do the same thing on the other side. Put the two plastic pieces in and then screw them together. And then um, put that clip back on to cover it up. And there you go. Now it is fully installed. I'm checking it over just to make sure everything looks okay. It's functional. And it's in there pretty strong. So... Uh, we're good to go. Here's the old headband pad. As you can see, it really needed to be replaced. It was getting pretty bad. And we also sell other parts for different models of headphones as well. Uh, different Sony models. Uh, we have replacement ear pads and also the slider parts on the headband that seem to break quite often. We have our own custom designed replacement parts right here at Central Sound. So uh, we got your back when it comes to repairs for different models of Sony headphones. Uh, it seems to be a common problem, that part that breaks a lot. So have a great day. Thanks for watching.